Okay, hello. This is Trey with Texas Sports TV, and we just found out who the Houston's XFL head coach is going to be, and who else? Because we got the head coach and the team president. Okay, so. Okay. We got June Jones to Houston's XFL team. Now, he's a former Oilers and Gambler's assistant. Uh, he is 67, leaving his position as the offensive coordinator associate head coach of the Hamilton Tiger Cats of the Canadian Football League. So, the Tiger Cats, the Oilers, and the Gamblers. Jones was Hamilton's head coach last year. And Jones, who coached with the Gamblers in 1984 and the Oilers in 1997 and 88, has been head coach in the NFL with Atlanta and San Diego and in college with Hawaii and SMU. When the XFL began, so he has plenty of experience. That's pretty good. When the XFL, also, I really like that he's being an Oilers fan, so he definitely has experience here in Houston. The XFL begins in February 2020. The Houston team will play at TDECU Stadium on the University of Houston campus. Now, yeah, we understand it'll debut in 2020. Season. Jones' familiar name in the Bayou City as he's. Sai's coaching career with the Houston Oilers and the Houston Gamblers. I believe the Gamblers were the XFL team uh, back in 2000. Uh, Jones. Designed from Hamilton, the league and officials from XFL Houston are planning to announce Jones at the new team president, Brian Michael Cooper, this week. Uh, Cooper is a local attorney who previously has ties with Rice University along with the Rio Grande Vipers franchise, which serves as a developmental franchise of the Houston Rockets. While at Hamilton in 2017, Jones tried to hire former Baylor head coach Art Briles. After concerns materialized, the team released a joint statement with the CFL announcing they would not be hiring Briles. And now we get some information on Brian Michael Cooper, named team president. Now, the Houston attorney and sports executive Brian Michael Cooper was named Tuesday as president of the XFL Houston franchise that will begin play next February. Cooper is a former president of the Rio Grande Valley Vipers and the Rockets affiliate, which is the Rockets affiliate in the NFL G League. Now, the former senior associate at the director at Rice University. He also has been a partner at law firms in Houston and Denver and director of sports programming for Dish Network. Now, Cooper will oversee ticket sales, corporate partnerships, marketing, community relations, and game day fan experience programs for the Houston team. And there we go. Uh, he's attorney Brian. The Houston-based attorney. Not much information, really. I just we just know who they are. This is just more of the same thing. And if they trust to, he has uh, began his career as a legal intern with the NFL. So there's the some football experience. Then worked for several law firms in New York and Houston areas. He worked on legal cases such as the NBA lockout, an antitrust suit against Major League Soccer, and a suit against the NHL. Cooper has a law degree from Columbia Law School in New York. He began his delegate career at Cornell University in Ithaca, New York, where he received a bachelor's degree with concentration in government and philosophy. He later received his master's degree in Public Policy from the Harvard Kennedy School of Government, Cambridge, MA. Cooper is also a member of both the State Bar of Texas and the New York State Bar Association. He will join new head coach June Jones to help guide the Houston franchise. So, not too much information. 
uh, here. We just know that, well, we got a head coach now, finally, and we got a, a team president now, finally. So, you know, things are looking up pretty good for Houston, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I would like to see what he can, what players come here, which I don't know too much about the players. Uh, I'll let a lot of these players I won't know too much about, but I would like to know who the players are and what he can do with those players. I think that's more important. You can take a bad head coach and he can end up really good with the right players or a good head coach in the bad with the right wrong players. It's just, I don't, we don't know exactly how this is going to work out yet. We just know we got a head coach now with football experience, with Houston experience, and Houston has a president now. So hopefully we'll be getting actual bigger news with the team name and logos soon i'm still waiting for that but this you know i haven't been doing the other teams but this is texas sports and houston is texas so yeah i thought i'd do this i don't know i just don't have too much to say how long has it been oh, six minutes okay well i don't know what do you guys think about this you think it's a you, you, you think it's good? You think it's bad? I don't know. 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 I don't know.